We're now in the upper 50s, near 60. We do have a wind off the lakeshore that's keeping a few communities on the warmer side. 70 degrees in St. Joseph here this morning, 68 in South Haven. A lot of areas in the upper 50s, near 60 inland now, but we're still 30 minutes away from sunrise, if not a little more. 55 in Three Rivers, Cassopolis, Hartford, 57 Allegan Hastings, 56 in Hudsonville this morning, 58 in Fremont, 59 now up to 60 in Spring Lake, 56 degrees in parts of Montcalm County as well. We're all going to be more moderate with our temperatures today as cloud cover is going to be pretty much gone. The only difference between yesterday and today is more sunshine and temperatures a touch warmer as well. Mid 70s expected all across West Michigan, but lower 70s along the lakeshore where we're still going to have that westerly wind pick up. A few areas starting to see now a three to five mile per hour wind areas inland, Holland up towards Hart. Uh, things are staying quieter there along the lakeshore. Already a sustained nine mile per hour wind in Benton Harbor that really hasn't let up much to, uh, overnight. Through the afternoon, peak winds will be 10 to 15 miles per hour and gusts upwards of 25. So another breezy one's ahead, but it's not going to feel as bad as our sunshine is going to be a little more abundant than it was yesterday. We still had some decent sunshine, but again, today's just going to be a better day for it. Lakeshore communities still going to be contending with some strong rip currents, some pretty choppy waves out there. Whitecaps going to be rolling and active, mostly sunny skies though. And come the evening hours, once that sun does start to set, the winds are going to cut back significantly and we should see pretty calm conditions for the evening hours. Now at the ballpark, it's going to be even better viewing here uh, right uh, along the afternoon hours. First pitch at two o'clock, temperatures in the mid 70s, mostly sunny skies actually eventually leads to a few hours of full sunshine. And the only thing there is going to be that breeze, but that's going to be pretty refreshing at the ballpark with that sun beating down while you're sitting in the, in the stands. On future track here this morning, picking up on isolated shower, tracking down near Kalamazoo. That is in Allegan County right now, but it's very, very light. Through the uh, evening hours, we stay with mostly sunny, if not full sunshine. So conditions pretty good here for the end of the weekend outside of the wind. Into Monday, temperatures will be a touch warmer through the afternoon, but a little bit more cloud cover, and there will be some rain showers around as well. I think we could see a few areas uh, pick up a couple hundredths of an inch. Most of the rain does look light, but again, it's enough to constitute a few afternoon showers here Monday on the forecast. 80s look to return for a few days here, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. But come next week, Thursday night and Friday, looks like another system setting up for us. Timing really looks like it starts to arrive late Thursday afternoon, lasting into the evening of maybe even Saturday as this low kind of develops over the Great Lakes and just kind of broadens its horizons in the region. So we could be looking at a few days of some decent rain here starting Thursday afternoon.